Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory Saturday Night. Link to the past randomizers coming at ya. Starting off with a normal open randomized swords plus enemy rando and pot shuffle. Defeat Ganon Seed. Let's see. Uh, last week wasn't too bad. I think we had a slightly over two hour seed going on. It wasn't too terribly rude to us, um, but there's always room for it being less rude to us. So let's hope we get the less rude variant tonight. So let's get it going in three, two, one. Go, 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 go. What's in the house today? First chest is a big old 20. The rest of Uncle's life savings. That's okay. We'll put it to good use. We'll put it to good use, maybe. Perhaps. Perhaps we shall. Put it to good use. Enemies are friendly to this here. I don't know that we're gonna get one there. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh boy. I don't know that this... Does that count as a kill? Is that gonna get us our tree, tree pull here or no? Nope. Okay. Dang it. That's alright. That's okay. We didn't need that. We didn't need whatever that was. Alright, so we got an anti-fairy down here. That's not too terribly difficult to maneuver around. Uncle, what you got? A fiver! Wow! <laughs> he took 20% uh, of the life savings and just ran away like a little fuck. Oh, we got two anti-fairies in here. Interesting. And another fiver! Wow, what a... What a shitty start. <laughs> What a shitty start. My goodness, just a, a little bit of money. Like, not even good money, either. Like, just a, a tiny bit of money that's not even useful. Fantastic. Alright, well that's- you know what, that's fine. That's fine, we can- we can make a go with this. Some chain chomps in the overworld? Oof. That's rough, but good thing you got lots of room to maneuver around them. Really? That should be enough for the tree pole, at the very least. Can't really do fish rescue because there's no water around here. Oh, some arrows on the tree pole. Okay, well that's also worthless. What's this guy got for us? How about a bomb or something? No, another fiver? Ugh. I mean, I guess we could grab a fish and go take it to the, the vendor in Kakariko. 300 on the, the lumberjack ledge. You know, that's good money, but not good enough money to spend six and a half, seven minutes to go get it, so. Small magic that time. Yeesh. Be able to do the, the crab checks, are we? That's all right. That's okay. What about Mushroom Spot? Uh, a big 20. You know what? We're gonna grab it because that gets us enough money for bombs. <laughs> it gets us enough money for bombs. Which is probably what we're gonna have to go buy because the item pickups have not been very, very helpful. Oh, well, at least we got, a, we got a bottle. Okay, so that puts Sick Kid on the table right away. So that's something. I suppose. It's not much of something, but it's something. Um, you know what? I think I am going to go grab a fish and take it to the vendor, so at least we can get a few things. Spike roller going on there. I think there was just one up here, right? Yeah. Alright, fish, let's go. Get us some goods, I think, what is it? He gives us a bomb, some arrows, and some money, I think? Um, excuse me. Um, damn it. <laughs> oh, I need to get- alright, fuck it, let's just go over this way. <laughs> he is guarding that area very zealously, and I don't appreciate it. I always forget what he gets, what he gives you for giving him a fish. Um, okay. Yeah, there you go. I have a fish. Oh, he gives us an eight popper of bombs. That's fucking fantastic. All right, good, good. Now we don't have to go buy bombs. Save our money for something else. Maybe 
Kia Creek will be a bit more helpful on the items. Well, that's not a good start. Neither is that. Ten arrows and a piece of candy? Okay. Oh, Sank Heart. What a waste. Down Power Glove. Alright, now we're talking. Now we're talking. And half magic is pretty good, too. Okay. Okay. And now we've got enough cash for Bottle Vendor, so, you know, things are starting to look up a little bit. If we could get the flute in the well, that would, uh... That would complete Light Side Kakariko all in one swift stroke here. That would be fantastic, but... Having said that now, I doubt it's gonna happen. Another piece of candy. Another hard container. Okay, you know what? Hard containers are good. That's that's good. I'm happy to see that. A big old 20. The boots! What are those? Another piece of candy. Alright! Okay. Okay. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. I can appreciate that. What do you got for a hundred bucks though? Some blue mail. Hey, 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 hey. Alright. That's, uh, that's, that's saleable. It's doable. Chicken hut. Oh man. Uh, we've got our, our work cut out for us in chicken hut here. Alright, we gotta, we gotta get around them and hopefully maneuver them such that we can make it out in one piece. Okay. And the Titan's Mitts, holy shit. Wow, Kakariko stacked. Both lift upgrades in short order. All right, well, that's that's good. I mean, I didn't want to have to be looking around for that, but... Hmm. That puts King's Tomb and Bonkrox on the table right away. And Fire Rod from the Sick Kid, oh boy. Okay. All right, I can, I can get down with this amount of equipment here. Piece of candy there. Should be good for a fill-up and a new heart container. All right, all right, all right. You know what? Not bad. Not bad. Not a bad cack. Right there. I'll take that. 100% take that. Plus, we can get whatever's in the library if it's something of value. Is the value here, though? It's a good question. Oh, a sword! You, we will take the sword. Absolutely 100%. Got a little stabby weapon. You got a weapon. That's good. That's very good. The best, in fact. I'm a race game. Race game is nothing but busy bams. We don't care about that so much. No oh, siree. Alright, so even though we've got probably a fair amount of stuff we can get if we start at Sanctuary, let's continue on to South Shore. As one does. Utility item there. That's all right. Half magic. That's actually very useful. What about under the water? Got anything under the water? Three hundo. Okay. It's fresh. Through their life savings uh, in the water. Can't really blame them, I guess, but you know what? It is of no value to that tiny little pond. Oh, geez, that is a lion. Oh, excuse me, sir. I think that was a straight up three hits. Three hearts right there. Ooh. Okay, what you gonna do for us today? Some Vista Bams, Red Potion, big old 20, another big old 20, and a piece of candy. All right, well, it's not, not the greatest, necessarily. Oop, sirs, excuse me. Oh, for fuck's sake, really? He body blocks me just straight up? What a shit. 
Okay, well, then we're gonna make a judgment call here and leave Ice Rod Cave alone for now. Uh, yeah, I can do Back of Escape, can't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so we'll do King's Tomb, we'll do Bonk Rocks, and then Back of Escape. Then we'll probably do Front of Escape. Uh, we could even attempt to do Dark Room, which would be uh, Shovel. Oh boy, the fetch quest that nobody wanted. Fantastic, thanks. Could even try to do uh, Dark Cross. Oh, jeez, excuse me, sir. Try to do the Dark Room and Escape as well, but I don't know if I want to do that. Like, we could, we could give it a go. With enemy rando turned on, it's a bit of a... It's a bit of a, a crapshoot. On us being able to get through it, just because it could be anything down there. A moon Pearl! Wow! Okay, um, I believe that's Dark World access. It sure is. Amazing. Okay, well, that's something. Not exactly what we wanted to see super early, but... You know, it's, it's okay, I guess. Eh. Big ol' 20. 10 arrows. The burrito. Okay, well, let's... Let's give this a go. I don't know that we'll be able to do it, but it's worth a shot anyways. Ouch. serves that guy's gonna have it isn't he um god we got fucking what are we doing all right he had the key <laughs> let's get the fuck out of there man oh. all right so now this is kind of dangerous only one heart As we now go down. Yep, okay. Alright, where is it? Oh. oh, fuck, fuck's sake, can I get bopped into an anti fairy? What a shit. Uh, where's this gonna put me? I'm actually kinda curious. Oh, this is gonna put me there. Okay, you know what? Let's go let's go for it again. Stop! Fucking... I know those were the Gibdos there, too. It's lame. You know what? Fuck it. It's too dangerous. We don't know what's going on. We're not going for it again. It was worth a go. We managed to navigate the room, but... Jeez, it's such a pain in the ass. Alright, well, now it's time for front side escape, then. Maybe we'll get a lamp, and we can actually do that. Tall order, but hey, maybe, just maybe, we'll get it. Sure. 
front side of escape has nothing too terribly fucking dangerous. It's always the dark rooms that are filled with all the spooks. Typical. We're pretty close to Zora Cash, though, so if we do manage to get five hundo before... Before too long, we might go up and take care of some business. The flute is incredible. Okay. <laughs> you know what? We'll take that. Pretty early on, and we're boots and the flute. Right in the way. So we're gonna activate that shit right away. So then we've got ourselves some fast travel. curious if we should just go into Dark World right away and then take care of some other things later on when we can route them in properly. I guess we'll do that. Oh wait, I don't need to go. I can't go around. I need to go through the front. Because I ain't got the hammer to get around the back. It's called Bumper Cave? Yeah. And we've got the... Oh, yes. Higher. We've got the cape to get whatever's up there, if we so choose. It happens to be something valuable. And it is. It's the flippers. Okay. Getting a lot of utility and mobility items, like, straight out the gate. It's kind of incredible. What the hell? I, for some reason, I can never get that first try. It's like, yeah, you're gonna fall at least once, idiot. Good luck. That's interesting in so much as uh, puts Zora very firmly on the table. We're lacking a little bit of catch. our cash problem solved. Except we're gonna burn, what, 30 rupees just for uh, the chess game, right? I why I went all the way around, but hey, whatever. It seemed like the thing to do. Offer a piece of candy. Boo! Boo, I say. That's right. Um, let's see what we got here. A green pendant at that, a normal ass crystal there, blue pendant at swamp is interesting. Uh, five sixers on pod and T rock. And normal ass crystals everywhere else, huh? Hmm. Isn't that an interesting set of shit to deal with, huh? But alright. Well, since uh, Thieves Town is a crystal, it's. Take a peeksy pokesy in, maybe we can just finish this off right away. Although we don't have the hammer. Oh, come on, really? It's 
So let's see what we can get out of it. Oh, there's an early big key. Drop, huh? Just be too many fucking sprites on the screen. Excuse me, sir. I guess. Pot shuffle here. Ah, incorrect. Well, at least we can check that hint on our way back up. Ooh, take that though. Yoink. One lamp and a unique item is fire locked in misery mire. The lamp is in misery mire. Are you fucking kidding me? Ah, oh, that's super lame. But I guess it's good that we know where it is. Ouch. Twenty there. I mean, that's nicer than to tell us where it is. But still, that is a lame spot. Oopsie. That's a lame spot for the lamp to be. A really lame spot. Holy heck. Okay. <laughs> and what was the other thing it said? It was lamp and uh, and something else. I don't remember what it said now. Well, until I learn how to do the rest of the dark rooms, the lamp is still going to be required for me. Stop! Stop! Stealing my bombs! Little shit. I need those. I was hoping that this is the last item here. Or that the last item is on the boss. Eh? Ah, crap. Well, no hammer, so no check the big chest. Stop bullying me. Get out! Out of here. <sighs> this boss isn't too unpleasant for us to deal with here. What are we dealing with, though? Oh, Armos, huh? Does the fire rod work? I mean, we can just sort him down, but... Oh, it does. Interesting. Oh, I'm out. I suppose I could. Yep. Okay. Should 
pretty happy this is a boss we can actually take care of while we're here. Ouch. Wow, I did this in pretty much the exact slowest fashion, <laughs> like hitting all the ones that were separated. better than just normal slashes. Well, it would really help if I didn't die here. That would be something. Oh, for the compass. Damn it, this means there's one item left in that chest. But at least there's Crystal 1, 25, 30 in. Not too terrible given my track record. But leaving that item behind is no bueno. No bueno, indeed. Hmm. Alright, well, uh, let's see. Skull Woods is a pendant, but it's the green pendant, so it might still be worth doing. And we are kind of in the neighborhood. We may as well go at least give it a give it a look see doodle. Didn't take too long to kind of clear out as necessary. Tarantula Town. <laughs> Big old 20. One of them. Either way, we're probably going to be doing a full clear of this, because... No mirror. Uh, there's a possibility that we should be able to beat whatever boss this is. Unfortunately, it's going to be... Fucking... Stop it? It's going to be on some conveyor belts, so it's going to be, well... One dumb bullshit fight. Fucking really? Of course they would bot me back into the wall master. It's so lame. I'm here with that. Oh, nice. Okay, that's what I wanted. Alright, we can just bop these guys around a little bit. There we go. Nice. 
That'll do it. Fuck it. I ain't dealing with him. Here. Oh, it's a vanilla mafula. Okay. Okay. You know what? That's that's doable. Not exactly great, but doable. Okay. Stop with the fucking spikes, please. And get your butt over here. Ass. There we go. Okay. That went pretty smoothly considering. Okay, for the last item. Give this the green pendant. So, well, time will tell whether that was a smart idea. But, we should be able to do... Well, it's unfortunate that we don't have a mirror. We should be able to do most of these other things while we're kind of... Bopping around Dark World. Okay. And we do have blue mail, which is fucking great, but the more hearts we have, the better. Uh, actually, no, let's grab what's his face first <laughs> before we leave the area. So we don't have the mirror. from old Stumpy. Thanks, man. I guess that's something. Start a hype cave. Ah, another sword. Fantastic. More bombs. More bombs. And a big old 20. Alright, well, the sword itself is probably good enough for hype cave. So that's something. So we're not gonna really have a whole lot of other means to get around here, so we're going to have to take a brief swim in order to get on to the other side. Pyramid and 
catfish. Probably be the last two we can get on this Dark World spin. Oh, geez, excuse me, sir. And then we'll have to hit up the Light World for a bit. We've got Zora Cash. We've got to go to Sasha Shasha Shula. Not up there. No. Ten arrows. Ten arrows! Ten useless arrows. With no D to fire them from. truly know. And the one hint we saw was that the lamp is in mire. Which has to mean it's not going to be too far before we get a medallion to open mire, right? <sighs> Waste. To get the medallion to open mire... Suppose we can also go check Agana. That is still kind of on the table. At Zora, we've got Sahash. Eastern, perhaps. We never did a, a thing check. Oh, Eastern's the other pendant. Crystals are Hera and Deserts. Okay, that's not what I really wanted to see, honestly. Let's hope an Eastern would have been the crystal. That's one we know pretty much we can do. Another 300, holy shit. All right, we're set for cash. We were set for cash, like, in the last 300. But I guess it never hurts to have a little bit more. Drop off the blacksmith and then flute over to Shashashashurla. Perhaps do the whole Zora thing. Including the waterfall and Zora ledge. Then we'll think about which dungeon we want to go into next. Eastern is always a, a not bad choice considering, but. Powder? That. Doesn't put Batman on the table just yet because we don't have the hammer or the mirror. Alright, let's go talk to Shashashurla. The Shurchul. Shashashurla. He'll give us four items since we've already got the pendant. Already got the good old green pendant from Skull Woods. Gives us the red mail. Hey, okay. You know, that's a... That's an interesting trade-off. Time for excellent defense. Arrows, piece of candy, and big old 20. Alright, so... Leaving Shashashrala for a little bit wasn't the worst choice. Uh... That's right, because we haven't done Ice Rod Cave yet, either, because we died on the way there. Because that dumb bullshit Lionel just body blocked us from the entire thing. Back when we were on the puny green mail. But no, not anymore. We're fully kitted out and ready to go. Another heart container, huh? Well, isn't that interesting? Okay, ten hearts is pretty good. Pretty good, we'll take it.
Ten arrows on the island. We don't care about that necessarily. Or at all. Go check our buddy Zehobo. He's got some good shit for us. Perhaps Samaria, perhaps the hammer, hookshot, a bow. Any of those would be real nice. Any of those would be real nice. Sir, if you're listening. One of those, please. Nope. Big old 20. Thanks. Thanks, I guess. Thanks, I guess. I suppose I could just split it back to 8, and that would have been faster. Oh well, too late. We're committed. Some good cardio in with the swim. Try to fake flipper down here, that could have been a little messy. Another big old heart container and a big old 20, okay. Again, not exactly what we're looking for here, um, but the extra health is probably fine. It's got a bug net there, you know what? That's a, that's a good backup item. We're probably gonna grab it. Yeah, 500 bucks for 20 in return. No thanks. You can keep it. You can keep it. I just spent 500 bucks. What's another 20, I suppose? We'll take that. That gives us some good backup strats for, say, G Tower. A couple bottles to deal with so we can get some fairies. leave us a lot of places now, does it? Ledge, some biz the bams We don't really care about. Some more piston pants. Okay, cool, great. That's like all of the bombs, thank you. That's enough of those, please. Oi. So that's not leaving us a whole lot of other places we can go here, unfortunately. We can go up the mountain. We can get purple chest, we can go into Eastern. We've got Meyer Shed here coming up. We need, we need Bombos for Meyer. It's not. Oh my god, what is this? Two fucking spike rollers. <laughs> Assholes. Big old 20 there. And a single ass root there. Okay, cool. Meyer Shed was fucking worthless. Hmm. It really doesn't leave a whole lot of options, does it? Interesting layout of this room. <laughs> with the enemy rando. Oh, nice! Found the hole! <laughs> it's found it straight up, no worries. It's right there.
Oh, good. The Arrow of Destiny. Well, runs halfway valid now. Soon we open validation chest for formula on refight. The run will be valid! Yay! <laughs> Uh, we got, oh, there's Bombos. There's our ticket into Meyer. Inside is just the, oh, the other single-ass root. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do purple chest. We're gonna grab purple chest. S and Q out, take care of that, and then head on over to Eastern, because that's going to be pretty much our only real play here. I guess we can go into Pod. We can go into Ice. Ugh. Neither of those sound like real good ideas. Unfortunately, given our current equipment. So missing the bow. I... I suppose technically we could do ice. Oh no, we don't have hammers, so we can't finish ice. That's why it's all yellow and red and sitch. Don't leave it inside, that'd be silly. Clack. Wah, wah. Still not entirely useful, but there it is. guard that got the poop brown armor of the day. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> Oops. So they were late to roll call. chance. Okay, it's not the best of starts there. Big key in the compass. Means we'll be doing at least one dark room. In the hopes that we won't need to do the second one. Because that one's the worst of the two. Although with enemy rando it can be better or worse. on that one. What the hell? <laughs> mm, never quite sort that one out. Oh, hey! There's a mirror. Incredible. Well, that opens up a lot more. <laughs> Including our ability to get the Bombos to go into Myers. Some bombs is in Mimic Cave. Alright, well, that's good to know. I'll just ignore that then, huh? Big old hard container there. Okay. Alright, so Eastern was definitely a thing we needed to do. <laughs> Pendant or not, because of that dumbass mirror.
No, we'll go up, idiot. What the hell's the damned key? <laughs> Pot I didn't get. No. Is that a pot? No. There it is. <laughs> it's like, come on, pick the fucking thing up. Fuck up there. Interesting. What? And the burrito. Shit. Well, we can still maybe finish this if I do that other dark room properly. Hmm. Bank on that final item being something we're going to need. Got it! <laughs> wow, that... Man, that room sucks. <laughs> that room sucks with enemy rando in the dark there. But we made it. Seven-eyed Wormulon this time around. Just for ten bombs. Boo. Okay, well we got the mirror out of that cluster. That puts a few other things on our radar. Time being, I think we'll go up to Death Mountain, we'll take care of Hera, that's another crystal at the very least. We can pick up Bombos on the way through, that'll get us into Mire, which will get us the lamp. Make dark rooms a thing of the past. Can decide where to go from there. Probably desert. We could do mire and desert back to back. Should be real nice. We'll have to decide where to go after that. Considering we're still missing a fair few items. Really hammer. Uh. I hope we're not going to need Ice Rod, but it's probably a foregone conclusion at this point that we're going to. But, you know what? We'll see. We'll try Stop trying to predict the future, just live the present, and we'll see what happens.
Bottle and the shield is in Western Wing of Swamp Palace. Alright, well that rules out Western Wing of Swamp Palace, doesn't it? Now, I just need to remember that when the time comes and we're going through Swamp. If we need to go through Swamp. Since it's the other pendant. Oh, fuck's Nice. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> exactly what we wanted to do there. and Kakarika well. Thanks! Already knew that. <laughs> Already fucking knew that. Right, that should be good. All for, all for the burrito. Great. <laughs> I almost got knocked in regardless. Fantastic. Alright. Well, boss will have the final item. Let's hope it's a boss we can beat. It's Argus. We're fucked. Oh, bastard. Uh, Helmosaur we could probably do, although it's gonna be awkward and not tiny-ass platform. It's a Helmosaur. <laughs> Alright, well, we got nine bombs. Let's give it a go. Nice shot. I don't know that that counted. I think that counted. Okay, good, good. Oh, that's not good though. Oh, oh, jeez. Okay. Couple more bombs. Ah, dang it. Couple more. Come on, man. Uh oh, one more. Gonna make this count. Yeah, just barely. Okay. I don't fall down, idiot. Nice. Oof. Okay. <laughs> It could have been real bad if we fucked that up. Key. Did I not get the second item? Oh yeah, I did. I just forgot to mark it off. I think. Or no. Ooh, we're gonna have to go back in and check, because it might be in the basement. Let's dip in real quick, menu in, and see if we got both the compass and the burrito. Damn it, it is in the basement. Alright, I guess that's fine, whatever. Got nothing better to do. That's crystal too, by the way. That's not gonna do it. I don't have anything to hit that delayed like. smiley face. Sort of. Isn't that nice? <laughs> 20 rupees. whoop the fucking do <laughs> A poor exchange. Poor use of our time. first, just in case there's, like, a tempered sword in there. That would make this a little bit easier. So I could use some more bombs since I used all of them on, uh, Helmosaur there. Mm -hmm. 
Hey, silver arrows, though. Hell yeah. Silver was scanning for us tonight. Once we find the D. So it said the lamp was fire locked. And there was some something else. I think it was the lamp and some other piece of trash that we don't care about. So once we find the lamp, we can just book on out of there. Be checking these down here too, just in case the. Oh, yeah, there it is. But it matters terribly right now since we're gonna be leaving the room. But it's good to know that it's down there. Oh, we're not gonna be able to finish Meyer anyways without the Samaria, Cane of Samaria. So, I guess we'll just bop in for the lamp. We'll bop in, grab the lamp, bop out, and then continue on our merry way. Say, did that hint say the ice rod? Oh, maybe it said like a compass or something. Well, the ice rod's good too. Like, that's fucking great to have. So then, we don't fucking need to worry about running into Trinex on one of these boss things. Oh, if those bombs are gonna disappear before we can grab them, we could actually use those. Or maybe not. Maybe they don't. Fantastic. Perfect. Okay, there's our lamp. that we can't just knock it out immediately, but whatever. Okay, it is in Blind's Hideout. Uh, did we already get a unique item in Blind's Hideout? I don't remember now. Pretty sure maybe we did? Arrows. 
Oh boy. One in chan ten chance of getting that button on the first go. We'll take it. Take whatever little luck comes our way. Hookshot, Hammer, and Samaria. Got the lamp now, actually. Ooh, that was close. Not if I'd had enough magic or not for that. I suppose I do have a, a magic potion just in case things go super wrong. Fight, if a little slow, because we only had uh, Master Sword. That's alright. It's Crystal Number Tray. Okay. Well, what does that leave us here? Gives us a few Dark World locations we could hit, some one-offs, we could go for, say, <clears throat> actually I'm not quite sure where we should go. It's not a lot of, not a lot of choices and none of them are that great. Probably Pod would be the place to go, it's the highest item density. We can only do the one front chest in Swamp, we've got a couple overworld locations we can hit. You know what? No. Let's, um... Let's continue what we're... Let's do the overworld locations first, since so we can get the three in the Dark World uh, all in one go, and we'll have to do the... <clears throat> I'll have to do the Dark Room and Escape one more time. I'll watch that'll be the bow or something. Some really cool shit that I couldn't get without the lamp because I'm bad at this. Fairly close together, except mm, kind of doing this in a very oddball fashion since we need to mirror out for Batman. We can't get in without uh, coming back in the dark world, anyways. Whoa, um, excuse me, what the hell is that? 
<laughs> well, that was weird. There was just a head flying at me. Still 20 up there, of course. Well, that's unfortunate. back up for Batman. Then we'll have to choose which one we want to dip into. I think I'd probably do Pod over Ice or Swamp at this point. Just playing the numbers, you know? there. Okay. Cool. I would have been chasing down pocket change. It's the best. Oh, Batman, that's right. It's like, huh, wait a minute, I already did Blacksmith and Purple Chest. What am I doing over here again? <laughs> Plus all three of those. Can't wait for this fourth one to be equally worthless. Another big 20, or 10 arrows, or three bombs, or something. That's my estimation of it. Let's see what RNG will deliver, though. the gate. That's fucking irritating. This room is okay. Just need to maneuver it. This one I think was also okay. Things are pretty well partitioned out. And this one was the real bitch because I think there were some, you know, there's some dragon heads. Oh, good. Just a big old heart container. Well, not truly worthless, but Probably not worth the time to go get. Oh, I can't even use that one because I don't have a fucking hammer. Ah, oh, that's irritating. So we're gonna have to go all the way the fuck around for this. Well, if that's the case, I may as well just go into ice then. <laughs> fuck it. Oh man. That's... Oh, I forgot about that. It's super hard. Ah, this is so annoying. Like, all the dungeons we need to go into, we can't finish because we don't have the item to finish it with. The bow, or the hammer, or whatever. Excuse me. Unique item requires the cape. Yeah, we got that already. What did we get out of that? I think it was the... I don't remember what it was now. I think it was something useful, though. Oh, it's the flippers. That's right.
Hmm, not exactly what I'm looking to see here. <laughs> if we do end up going in the swamp. We don't need to go on the left side, because it's just a shield and something else. Oh, is that going to be close enough? Oh. This part is an ice palace. Gee, thanks, I think we just got that one. <laughs> what a fucking pile. put the biggest body blockers in that narrow ass space. At least we don't have to loop around again. Very small key, are you serious? Ugh, it's annoying. So the boss is definitely going to have the last item, probably. Knowing my luck. What the? It doesn't even tell me which boss. It's fucking worthless. Oh, and I don't have the goddamn fucking hook shot. Oh boy, this could be a real mess then. Crap. I don't fucking know how to do this one really. That cover. Oh shit. Nice. I think I do this, and then I do. Okay, I think I shift over one there, do that, and then... Oh, come on! 
a little bit too far. So something like that. What? Oh, almost had it. I just need to be... And those fuckers need to fuck off. Like, right there. There we go. <laughs> the most ad hoc fucking bomb jump lineup I've ever seen. Oy. Okay. Well, I guess it worked. That's the best we could hope for. Oh, and I don't have the hammer for this? Ah, shit. Oh, I forgot you needed the hammer for that one. Oh, god damn it. Unless this is the hammer here. That would be something. Oh, no, but it is Samaria. Wow, okay. Um... Well, shit. <laughs> okay, uh... Hmm. Well... That is something, isn't it? Still leaves us with this portal as the only way we can get into Dark World. We have to make the whole fucking world tour just to get over to Pod. But now Meyer is beatable. So if we need something to do that's at least somewhat progress, we can go do that. But it's not going to yield any more items since we already got both of them out of there. Fucking lamp and the ice rod. Oy, this is a, a seed of many double dips and I'm not sure it's entirely my fault. Like, some of the routing is terrible, and that's on me, but some of these item placements are just bad, and that's not on me. This turns into Pod being another double dip, because we still need the bow and the hammer to finish Pod. The likelihood of both of those things being in Pod itself is... Not super slim, I guess, but slim enough for me to go, ugh. <laughs> like, this isn't going to be a good time. Not having either the hammer or the hookshot really rules out the entirety of Death Mountain. And it's treasure trove of items up there. We just can't get to it. We just can't. So after this, if this doesn't yield any results, the only other option we have is gonna be... God, another fetch quest. Is going to be... Um... Uh, the for your first chest in the swamp. Which, I've had important shit be there before, but I always just kind of hope in the back of my mind that that's not going to be the case again. Our container can be dug up. Uh, we already did that, yeah, that would have been the dig spot. Let's 
least one of these is gonna have to be a small key. This one will probably be as well, I would guess, right? Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Small key. Ugh, how irritating. Leave us many options here. This again. Bastards. Oh, come on, really? They put two of them there? Fuck you. Ugh. Hey, there's our tempered sword. Nice. Okay. There's a key. That is the entirety of all the small keys we're gonna need. Yeah, it has to be. Oh, there's butter! Oh man. Okay, two swords and pod. That's kind of incredible. some of these mazes. Which one is which? Level 20. For the odds this will be the last item here. Probably a 1 in 3 chance. 1 in 3 chance. Let's play the odds. Shika 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 boom. It's the burrito. Okay, well... So we're out of there. <clears throat> that leaves Mushroom and the first chest in Swamp. Oh boy, oh boy, oh fucking boy. But at least we got butter out of it, you know? That's something. That's something. That's a good consolation prize. Oh, man, there's the hammer. There it is. Okay, that gives us some... some options. The biggest of which is going to be Death Mountain. Behind the mushroom, which was in pod, which is a oh, it's not a pendant. I thought it was a pendant. 
which we couldn't have beat without the hammer, and we still can't beat without the bow, so that's fun. At least we can go uh, polish off ice if we so choose, which we may so choose soon. There's still one item there. There's also still one item in Thieves Town, which worries me a bit. I don't like leaving that one there, but we had no choice at the time. For the time being, let's console ourselves with, like, the 15 items up on Death Mountain. Well, less than that. Uh, probably only about nine we can get to. Well, no, ten. Eleven? Eleven. Eleven items we can get to right now. Uh, come here. Come here. <laughs> okay, we got Red Meringue up on... Up on Island. We don't really care about that. Also don't care about, but hey, it's in our way, so whatever. Exciting. Oops. Another bottle. There's the D. All right, good. Ten arrows. Piece of candy. Okay. Getting the D there. Definitely valuable. some value going on there. Uh, wait, do I care about... I probably don't care about this. Uh, well, no, I guess it's good to warp into Death Mountain here so we can check <clears throat> what we need for T-Rock. So I think we might have all the shit that we need to actually complete it. Equipment-wise... Which thing it is, and it's Vanilla Quack, which we have. So you know what? We're just gonna do it. We're just gonna go right in there and do it right away, because... Well, maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we should check uh, Hookshot Cave and Super Bunny. Just in case, like, one of those is the Hookshot or something, because that would make this a lot faster. Safer. 50 rupees does not make it any better. Plenty of money. a bust. Although I'm actually kind of wondering if we even need hookshot. We probably don't. Because we need to, let's see, one, two, three, four. Do we need hookshot? I suppose you technically do need hookshot for G Tower to get across the validation chest. And I'm no good at hovering, so that's out. Otherwise, we probably wouldn't need it at all. Hmm. And before hookshot is in the swamp, I bet. That would just be the thing to do, wouldn't it?
long way around to do this since we can't quick hop off without a hook shot. Small key. Jeez. through the middle anyways. There's a chance that could be an item. It's just gonna be a key exchange. Yep! Key exchange, damn it. Oi! Oi, oi, oi. since a hint already told us that it was trash. Burrito. Oh Alright, so laser bridge will pay out pretty good, as will, uh, as will the boss, I think. Must have something. So we got... Oh, no, we're still missing the compass. Right, there's the compass. Alright, so Laser Bridge will have three items plus a key, and then the boss will have the final item. Great. Fantastic. That's... oh good. Oh, for fuck's sake. Asshole. What? How is that fair? Dump a fat ass spike on a narrow ass bridge. Sandy. Key that we need. Out cheese. Oh, okay. Oh, easy. Ouch. Fifty rupees. Take the uh, back up outside escape here. Just in case, just in case things go wrong. 
We might take a death anyways, just to get some health back. Big old swans are fucking serious. Well, kind of our last holdout then is gonna be the boss. And then... Uh, just have to go around. Keep looking for shit. Ooh, excuse me. Boy, very tired tonight. Yeah, I've woken up at 8 a.m. for some bullshit on-call thing. Get back to sleep after that, so... Significantly missing some sleep that I would normally have on a Saturday. That was stolen from me. <laughs> Alright, now watch, this is gonna be Argus or something. That would be just the thing to happen to me. Oh my god, I didn't want it to be a thing! Ah, damn it! Son of a bitch! Also, T Rock's a double dip too. Fantastic! Oh, are you fucking for real with this? Come on, man. Come the fuck on! Ah, damn it. Wow, alright, cool. So, yep. Hook shot is 100% required here. Ah, oh, that's so lame. That's fucking lame. <laughs> oh, I hate it when I'm right. I really do. <laughs> bitch. Dang it. Ah, oh, it's so annoying. <laughs> so annoying. Oh boy. Yeah. Ain't nothing to do about it. But I think the good news is after we get hookshot, that's it. We're in go mode. 100% go mode. Once we find that thing that stretches and goes boing or whatever the description for it is, you know? I think of a lot of things that stretch and go boing though, so. No, it's not exactly unique. Dang it! It's just a piece of heart. Ugh. This is my cave. Why are you so dumb? Alright, well that leaves us with uh, some options at least. We can go do pretty much every other spot. Every other dungeon, except Swamp, I guess. Well, Swamp, we can only... I mean, I guess that's kind of the, the good... Upshot about all this is that we don't need to go in the swamp because the hookshot can't be can't really be in swamp unless it's the very first unless it's the very first chest in swamp. But that would be kind of worst case at this point because it can't be deep in swamp. It can't be on Master Sword pedestal. Um, it could. Oh. Not a magic it could, in theory, be the last item here in ice. It could be in Thieves Town. It could be the last item in Pop. Um, or it could be on a tablet or something, I guess, right? Technically, if we find the book. It could be on Ether or Bombos. Um, but it can't be Deep in Swamp or it can't be on MSP. So that's something. The little, the littlest silver lining there. It could be in Peg Cave as well. Check that yet. some small peaks here. Oh, did I fuck this up already then? No. No, no, not yet. So we technically don't need to do this bomb jump. So I've already got some Mario. Um, do I have the big key? I do. So I could say just fuck this bomb jump. But I really need practice at it, so we may as well do it anyways. Get first try again or something, yeah? See? Easy peasy. That one's easy. The other one, I don't know really a good lineup for it. Yeah, 
Got the bow this time, bitch. He ain't touching me. So, I think if I go this... Yeah, okay, yeah, this is perfect. This is perfect. Wasn't 100% on which room that led into. I'm glad it was this one. There's the item. All right, well, ten arrows. Whoop de doo tarantula town. safe, regardless of what boss this is going to be. I mean, unless it's another Argus, which it could very well be, because there's still dupes in the pool. We've still got some, some possibilities here where it can fuck us over. But that's kind of a long shot for it to be Argus, let's be honest. I'm going to get out of my face, asshole. Self-curses go here. Okay, it's not. It's actually a land mode, so that's good. That works. Alright, it's crystal four. Possibility is last item in pod. That will get us crystal five. Close. 
this is Nargus, I'm gonna be very upset. Okay. <laughs> Good. Oh, I guess because I got an extra flame rod shot in there. This is hook shot, that'd be the best, because then we can just go on our merry way. It is not. Well then, what does that leave us? Not a whole heck of a lot. It leaves us Peg Cave. Peg Cave, uh, the last chest in... Um... The last chest in Thieves Town, and the first chest in... In Swamp. That's really it. Unless one of those is the book, in which case our search space expands to include two more. Uh, let's bank on Peg Cave. That's the shortest one to check at this point. chicken. Come on, hook shot. Ah, shit. Okay, well then the next closest will be Thieves Town Big Chest. Damn it, it's the book. Oh no, that is not the one I wanted. <laughs> oh shit, okay. Well, that opens up two more. Great. Just the best. Ugh. That's annoying. All right, let's go check Bombos first. That's uh... Slightly quicker than ether, I think. At least in what we gotta do. This point finding hookshot on ether wouldn't be that bad because then we'd be up there for finishing off turtle rock anyways but 
We'll check this one since we're kind of sorta in the neighborhood. Double dip into like four of these goddamn dungeons because of how the item shook out. That's annoying. That's so fucking lame. Oh man. Alright, well, finally, 157 and change. We're in go mode. <laughs> Oi, what a seed. What a bitch ass seed this was. Doing, we'll be finishing T Rock last, which is always kind of good. The only better one to do last would be Hera. <clears throat> Considering he'd be right outside the G Tower, anyways, but. Yeah, you know, T Rock being second best is about what you could hope for. In the very last one in the lower right hand corner. Most fucking travel that we have to possibly do for this, of course. get for our troubles. Oh boy, ten arrows! <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Uh, crystal se oh wait, was that crystal seven? Did I miss... I missed, uh, doing a crystal there and somewhere. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. Oh well. Not, not like it matters. Splits really don't matter for randos. It's just fun. Just fun and for my info.
I know. Oh, I don't have the third, or the seventh crystal. That's right, because we gotta do, um... Shit, we gotta do, uh... We gotta finish Mire. Totally forgot <laughs> that we couldn't do Mire. Why couldn't we do Mire? Because we didn't, oh, because we didn't have, uh, Samaria. That's right, I should have done fucking... Should have finished Mire first. Oh well! That's me being an idiot. That's all right. That happens. That shit happens. Faster to go this way. Although we might not be able to get past because of the fucking switch. Damn it! <laughs> Forgot about that little detail. Oops. Never mind. Just tried to tried to go fast and I fucked it up. It's probably good that I got that key, honestly. That was probably a smart idea. Blind. Uh, is this gonna hurt me if I go up there? Sure will. This seems like kind of bullshit, though. Like, I guess I could have waited for him to finish his cycle and come down here, but at the same time, it's like, well, no, I don't want to do that either. That seems kind of silly. Gotta go fast, not gotta go slow. Strats then. Easy. Easy, easy. There's Crystal Seven. Alright, so I was sort of correct. Do 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 do
do do do do do do do be into G Tower by 209. Yikes. Not a good sign. Well, RNG gets one more chance to dick us over here. I don't know where that big key is going to end up. side never lets us down <laughs> except when it does Let's see what we got here's one and two small ass key big old 20 I don't know what the fuck that thing is flopping around there we really save the sprite glitching for uh, end credits ten arrows on the torch there's number three Just in case. I know I've got butt tons of health and shit, but just in case something goes wrong, having a backup fairy is not a bad idea. Alright, here's four through seven. Four, baby's first shield. Number five, small ass key. Number six, 300 roots. Number seven, piece of candy. Okay. Well, that's not a good start. Oops. Nice. Oh, for fuck's sake, really? Best to get around. And number eight, another small ass key. More keys for days. Candy. <laughs> oh boy, if this is deep in right side again, I'm gonna be very upset. There seems to be way too many seeds like that. Going against the numbers. There's 10 through 13. 10. It's candy. Number 11. Another piece of candy. Number 12. Hey, number 12. Alright. Not quite first half, but hey, we'll take it. Less rude than it could have been.
so the eyeball bats don't count at all for any enemy rooms. That's interesting. Cells of Vitreous in one of the refights. Okay. there. Yep, we have seen at least one of every, at least one of every boss. Very diverse boss rando here. Dupe cold stare and a dupe, uh, See another dupe of something else? Maybe not. Maybe just the cold stairs were duped. Nailed the triple there. Good double though. Ah, good. Get a chance to fire off there. Ah, the balls. Come on. Doing this to me this late in the game here. Stop. Come on. Fucker. Change minutes later, that's pretty average for me, I would say. Let's still make this a sub 220. We do this effectively. 
Got spare magic, spare health, and a backup fairy, just in case things go super wrong. Don't remember what it is now. I think that should probably be phase three by now. Just in case, we'll give it another couple taps. in the light world, you piece of garbage. Oh, come on, really? Yes. Might be able to pull a double off of this. Nice. Okay. Okay, not too bad. Even without the torch glitch, we nailed it pretty good. <laughs> there we go. Two eighteen forty-eight. Well, considering how much the seed dicked us over, that's not too bad. That really isn't the worst <laughs> value. <laughs> this is so silly. All right, prepare to fast forward. Let's go. Okay, let the credits roll. We'll see the stats, and then we'll call it a night. Amused at all the sprite glitchiness here. We got rocks made out of rats. We got vultures made out of bats. <laughs> People made out of weird snakes look like snakes there. We got uncle is a thief. And then a bunch of weird shit. <laughs> then the Zoras somehow make it out alive. I don't I don't understand. Stop hammer time. We have fucking hammer behind the mushroom. That's ridiculous. What a ridiculous bunch of bullshit that was. That's right, sick kid did have the... Did have the fire rod for us. That was a nice, pleasant surprise. Apparently Gary is a snake as well. <laughs> Only pocket change on MSP. Alright, at least it wasn't a pedestal seed. Had too many of those in my day. Like, maybe three of them. <laughs> Which is three too many. Alright, we'll let the credits roll. Hmm. 
<laughs> well, we got a we got the a sword fairly early because we got the boots early. And the sword, the first sword we got was in the library, so that was fun. We also had both lift upgrades in Kakariko, like within six minutes, which is incredible. Yeah, first sword, six and a half, boots and five, flute was pretty early too. Mirror was kind of late, which sucks, but whatever. So no swordless kills, so that's good. And we ended up getting tempered and gold sword in pod, I believe, right? GT Big Key was at 12. One of those deaths was intentional, at least. Maybe the second one was? I don't remember now. Not a great collection rate. That should be lower, but meh. Not too bad, considering how dickish that seed kind of was in the mid-game, again. 218.48. Alright, I can I can be kind of happy with that. But that'll do it for tonight. Uh, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CST. We got some Assault Android Cactus to practice. Get some Cactus practice in. Uh, probably not Infinity Drive tomorrow. We're going to be uh, moving on to something a little, a little bit different to prepare for some upcoming things. Alright, thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.